I started cycling when I was nine years old and I got diagnosed the year after. My father lives with diabetes, so he noticed the, the usual symptoms right away. I come from a very athletic family, so quitting sport was never an option. I got great support from my parents. My grandmother was meticulous with her type 1 diabetes management, and she just had this great, rich, full life. My mother, by comparison, had type 2 diabetes that was really poorly managed. And as a consequence, she always felt terrible and ultimately wound up on oxygen, and she just missed so much of life. When I was diagnosed, a couple of days after, I lost my professional cycling contract. And I think this is because of the lack of uh, information and knowledge about diabetes. Even my mother was concerned when I was diagnosed because my father had diabetes already and he didn't have the best management of the disease. Me, by having a healthy lifestyle, by riding my bike and some routines, helped him to get inspired by us. And this is also something that with the technology, innovation and knowledge that uh, every generation just gets better. For the first 10 years riding competitively, I used to hide my condition. For the last 10 years riding for Team Nolan Nordisk, it's empowering to share the condition and hopefully inspire the future generations to pursue their dream.